Now I remember, Fred told me he loved me and asked me to marry him. I was so happy.
I'm so glad you're back. As long as the transmitter on the town hall roof is operating, we won't be able to leave town. Please, disable the transmitter to disrupt Clark's control over the robots. I was able to strip one of its receivers, but this robot has got a strong hold on my hand. As far as I know, there's a remote control for the robot in the mayor's office. Try to find it, because the robot won't let me go otherwise. Here's a key to the mayor's office. I'm afraid I won't be able to help with much else. Be careful, Emily. And please, come back as soon as you can.
Emily, you're just as naive as ever. Thanks for reactivating my relay and returning the control over the city to me. Yes, I've got your precious friend, but that should be the least of our worries. You and I have an altogether different destiny. All right, Emily. Why don't you wait here a while? I'll be right back, and we will finally get married. This town will belong to the two of us, you and me.
Clark saw Fred proposing to me, and he heard me say yes. He was beyond himself with anger and jealousy. Apparently, he was also in love with me. In his rage, he told us we were going to be sorry. These are the blueprints of all of Clark's creations. He is indeed a man of genius. Judging by these blueprints, all of his mechanical helpers could be turned off using a control center near his home. This is where I need to go. <laughs> 